Come back, there's a slapper towards the net. Collins able to brush it aside. Sitch here on the near side for Fayetteville. He gets a hip check. A couple of players go down, and Sitch down on the ice. Now we're going to have some pushing and shoving, and now we're swinging the mitts as we got a couple two-on-ones and a brawl ensuing right down in front of us as they're going at it, everybody getting involved. And the referee's trying to sort this one out. Bunch of players down on the ice. And they got a big scrum. Everyone involved. Pyro down in there for the Cyclones. Looks like Falco on top. He's trying to be pushed aside. He's trying to drag bodies off as they're still trying to clear things out. Guys swinging and punching and fighting. Big pile right down in front of us at center ice. And that brings the fans to their feet. Ryan Bartle down there as well. Heinz for the Cyclones coming to his feet. So the referee's going to have a tough time sorting this one up. Hopefully we got enough room in the penalty box. Cyclones still upset as Bartle now slamming on the glass. He's talking over to the penalty box for Fayetteville. Heights in there as well. We're going to have to wait for the referees to sort this. Able to create a scoring opportunity. Five seconds and counting on that power play. So it looks like the Cyclones will go 0 for 3 on the man advantage. But we're going to get a penalty call and a hard hit as Hessler sends a Twin City player. And that is Bartle to the glass. And uh, down on the ice. Now Bartle comes up. Looks to be okay. But we're going to get a penalty called on Fayetteville as Bartle took a hard hit. And he's a little woozy. Cyclones control. Here's a steal by Sitch, and he's going to get a hip check as he goes down. That's the second time tonight. A hip check there. Might have caught him low as Sitch still down on the ice. Out at the top of the point there, just inside the blue line. The trainer's going to. 